with the FNR show. This is ET now. Good afternoon. Let's start off with you and your take on the market today. I think it's been going on uh, along the lines that uh, the market has presented itself with and uh, the going seems to be pretty decent because we are now almost on the doorsteps of the 6,000 level and uh, I'm sure if that were to be achieved, uh, it would certainly impart a very large dose of positive uh, upside trigger for the sentiment. I think a lot of people are awaiting the break past 6,000 to really get into the groove of things perhaps uh, but uh, you know having said all that we really cannot overlook the fact that uh, we have been going up for several days and weeks together and uh, the last significant low in the market was exactly about a year ago in December of 2011 so we should not be unmindful of that fact that uh, we are far away from where we were and uh, while uh, let's say buoyancy and uh, this kind of bullishness can be somewhat exhilarating. It should not be overlooked that all good things uh, periodically come to an end before they do resume. So my expectation is that while the going is good, we should continue with, uh, with long positions. But uh, th I think maybe the time has now come when we should also have, uh, you know, at least a wary eye on the exit door and see where it is in the scheme of things. We have been long on the bank nifty and uh, we have achieved the target 12,350 is where I had projected the target. So uh, the profits on bank nifty could be booked by those who are holding minimal lots. Those who are holding more can revise their stop loss to slightly below the 12,000 marks or even up to around 12,100, 150 mark and then continue to hold on for whatever it is that the market is willing to give us. But as of fresh trades, I do not really recommend anything new.